answer is Keller ISD's David Clemens. The question, who is the most rockin' and only local history teacher who appeared on Jeopardy tonight? <laughs> Our Ken Molasina spent the evening with a pretty anxious student body cheering him on. Ken? Yeah, and you know, Doug, the show actually pre-recorded some time ago, so this entire time, Mr. Clemens had to be mum about the whole thing. He had a great poker face all the way up to tonight when he got to see the show, along with some of his biggest supporters, his students. Let me tell you something, he did not disappoint. Let's go, Clemens! Let's go! The watch party kicked off with a pep rally atmosphere at Keller High School. But these cheers and high fives weren't for the football team, but rather a beloved history teacher. It's the kind of teacher that really touches your life. 11th grade U.S. history teacher from Fort Worth, Texas, David Clemens. Living out a goal he'd set for himself more than 30 years ago. It's been a 33-year dream to get to be on Jeopardy, so it was very exciting. Keller High students and staff packed onto the lunchroom tables to see Mr. Clemens take on other teachers in this week's teacher battles on Jeopardy. He supports us so much in his life, and I just really wanted to pay that back to him. Kids in the community have been super supportive of the work that I've done here. David. Who is Truman. Yes. And as he answered question after question correctly, <laughs> applause broke out, leading to the final question of the game, which Mr. Clemens nailed, making him a Jeopardy winner and a semifinalist. I'm very excited about that and honored. It was a very close game. It could have gone either way. Hoping that he goes all the way. You know that uh, semis, uh, semifinals game, that's this Monday. And folks, that was also pre recorded. Mr. Clemens is staying mum about that as well. He's saying that he signed a contract, so he's keeping his mouth shut. He's not allowed to talk about what will happen on Monday, but he is promising that it will be very fun and it will be a great show. And just so you know, he's playing for $100,000. Ken, don't let us leave you without just letting everybody in on the timing of the phone call with him and yeah. the fact that he got on the show. Uh, tell us the backstory on that, real quick. So this has been a long time coming. You know, he's been wanting to get on this show, as you just heard, uh, since 1984, since he saw the first show uh, back some 33 years ago. But when he finally got the call last year that he was going to be on the show, he says that call came in about a week after he laid his mother to rest. So he was already kind of grieving, uh, feeling a little down with uh, the circumstances of uh, things that were going on. And, Doug, he got that call, the call that uh, he'd been wanting to get for 33 years. So a lot of excitement out here at Keller High School and a lot of people rooting him on. We're going to see what happens on Monday. And, <laughs> Go, and Mr. You, Clements. You know his mama's smiling down. All right, Ken, thank you so much. Yeah. We appreciate it. Great story. Yeah, guardian angel involved.